What is going on guys? Welcome back. Comment here for you all Pro Football 2K. Kind of an interesting play here. I want to talk to you about the strategy involved in this game. I'm playing against the Rustlers. They've got Mike Rozier, number 30, their fullback. They've got Sammy Ball, number 33, their quarterback. And they've got Paul Horning, number 5, their halfback. So kind of an interesting number set by today's standards. But you can see here a wide receiver screen ran by Horning. And the interesting thing, and I don't know if Madden does this at all, and if they do, I don't think they do it enough. As you see, they come back out, Horning lined up as the halfback. He's going to get a, a pretty good run to the outside because they focus to the left where they've got their gold lineman and tight end. So when you're playing this game and you see personnel changes, you see formation adjustments, you see key players, star players, focal point players really, being moved around the field in different positions so that the team can take the best advantage of them. It's not something you're used to seeing in Madden. At least I don't think we see it in Madden enough. And not that there's a lot of players in today's NFL, the level of Paul Horning or what Paul Horning was, but you still certainly have players that can exploit matchups. And a lot of times in Madden, you just don't see that. A player plays his position that's what he does, and you don't have to worry about, for example, maybe a halfback going out as a wide receiver or a wide receiver coming back as a halfback. The only thing you really have to be concerned with and mad more often than not is, well, are they going to run the option? And to me, that's just not strategy level football that I want to endear myself to, that I want to play. I want a game where you see like all pro football, where they know they have a star player, they know they have a special athlete on the field, and they're going to do different things to try to get the ball in his hands in open field or try to get him mismatched against different defenders that may not be able to tackle him as best or as freely as maybe the linebacker or defensive lineman that he's normally going to see running the ball when he's going up against, say, a cornerback or a safety. Love to know your thoughts on this. Appreciate you checking it out, and you know that I'll be back in the week with more commentary.